And now we are approaching the Palace of Darkness. This is Mangadu901 here. We're continuing our our playthrough of Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. <clears throat> As you can see here, so these things are very stubborn. And the way inside the palace spots what appears to be some kind of thorny hedge maze. Well, at least the enemies drop good loot. <laughs> Haven't even been here for a long time and already I'm rich. There's an arrow pointing the way in, but... Hang on a sec. Hmm. Looks to be way up there. I'm gonna go check out that section first. I'll be right back. And inside, what appears to be a shop. There's a shield, bombs, and red potion. Hmm. No different from the other shops I've seen so far. But, uh, of course, this place was where the uh, potion shop was back in the light world. Hmm. No way up from the falls. So, it looks like I'll have to swim back. Great. Okay. This is where Zora's river is. Curses to anyone who throws something into my circle of stones. What sign? We don't need those stinking signs. Okay, what's coming out? That's a big carp. A medallion! The Quake Medallion! I think I'll enjoy using this. But I don't think we're gonna be coming back here anytime soon. 
So, uh, nothing. So, may as well head back to the Palace of Darkness. These are some ruins here. Let's see, is this the place? Nah, uh, I think it'd be more grander. You're looking for the... It will obey only the first person who touches it. Oh. What did the golden harvest feed the man who created this place? The Triforce. Something that'll be very big in Zelda lore. Ah, nothing but hearts. Would have been great if it was low in health, but... Fingers can be choosers, I guess. But anyway, let's see if we can find a way in. Oh. Careful of those big guys throwing stuff. Birds. Okay, so far so good. Alright. This way maybe? No. Uh, this way's no good. Let's try this way. Let's see. Is it just me, or is there something behind me? Oh, I hope... I hope I'm wrong. Okay, let's see. The, a monkey! Kiki. Where have I heard that name before? Oh, well, I got Ruby... Oh, well, I got rupees to spare. <laughs> okay, looks like we're at the entrance now. A hundred! Ah, oh, come... Hmm? hundred, really? How many bananas do you intend to buy with those? Well, I guess I should be thankful a minute. I guess I should be thankful it opened the door for me. So now we are in the Palace of Darkness. Mind you, while I was playing this, I was going in rather blindly. Seeing as I haven't played this in, in what? Five, six years? Five, six, ten years? Or was it seven? But I digress. Okay. I think there was a switch. Thank good. There we go. 
And here we have a chest. Okay then. Let's see what's on the other side. As soon as I can find the switch out of here. Alright, now that that's done. Let's see what's on the other side. Zelda locked in Turtle Rock on top of Death Mountain. Well, at least we managed to open a way in. And of course, I think it goes without saying not to touch the jellyfish when they are emitting electricity. Ha! I knew it. Huh, here's a bunch of new guys. Now, the green guys you can easily defeat with your sword. But the red guys, which I didn't figure it out until much later, can only be defeated by arrows. Uh, think back to those Armos Knights back way back in the Eastern Palace. <sighs> yeah, it took me a long time to figure it out. So, I'll just get back to you. Now going through the middle door, find a couple of new enemies. More jellyfish. Oh great. I just locked myself out. Let's see where this way goes. Oops, wrong button. <laughs> Give me a sec. Oh no, not these guys again. Well, I seem to be over a deep chasm. Hopefully, I can just push these guys off. I'll just throw. Oh. Uh, no effect. What do we do? I'll be back. This will take a while.
And as you saw previously, I fail. This is one of my epic fails. <coughs> now that I push that block in the right direction, I find a chest with a small key. <coughs> Alright, let's see what's on the other side then. Just need a good dash. Uh, no entry. Time to go the other way then. Whoa, a collapsible floor! Did not see that coming. Just get across. Huh. That was close. Hmm. More of these turtle guys. Oh! And another compass. Hmm. There's stair... Uh, another bomb. Huh, there's stairs heading downwards. Let's see what's in them. Oh, pretty dark in here. Let's light things up. Oh, jackpot. Look at all these rupees. Uh, better be careful of those fire things. Yeah, that's the bad thing about those guys. You lose both health and magic. Okay, more arrows. And another small key, which I will definitely need. Okay, how much... How much do I really need? Oh, looks like I found the interest to the boss. Fortunately, I don't have the big key. Nor do I have a way in. Yet. Alright. There's another chest. Let's see what's in this one. Five rupees. Why was I expecting something a little... I don't know. Richer? 
wrong button again. Now I know where the big key is. Now I just gotta figure out what next. Yeah, it's gonna be trick to get past through here. Well, without getting hurt. Okay, I see cracked floor. Thankfully, there's a floor below it. Otherwise, it'd be otherwise it wouldn't be bombing it. There's a path up. There's a path, but I don't have a key. Let's see what's down here. Uh oh. More skulls. Ugh. Ah! A small key. Just what I needed. Which includes these hearts. Huh. Back on the lower floor. Time to head back up. And by using the key on the door on the previous floor, I got the big key. And now it's time to make myself scarce. Alright, now where's that freaking switch? There we go. Alright, so far so good. Now let's see if we can, uh... Now that I have the big key, maybe I can finally open that big chest. Question is, how do I get there? That's the question of the day.
Yeah, this is a really awkward way of getting hit with arrows. I think, I'm sorry, but defeating these red guys. Whew! Barely missed me. Uh, anyway, next time we'll be exploring more of the Palace of Darkness. <laughs>